Hello and welcome to our channel. Today we're excited to bring you a list of 18 young adult gay novels that you won't be able to put down. So, without further ado, let's get started. Our first book is, The House in the Cerulean Sea, by T.J. Clune. This magical novel follows Linus Baker, a caseworker for the department in charge of magical youth, who is tasked with investigating an orphanage for magical children. Next up, we have, Aristotle and Dante Discover the Secrets of the Universe, by Benjamin Ali Ray Sants. This coming-of-age story follows Aristotle, a lonely teen, who befriends the charming and enigmatic Dante. Together they navigate the complexities of growing up, friendship, and first love. Moving on, we have, Red, White and Royal Blue, by Casey McQuiston. This political romance follows Alex, the first son of the United States, and Prince Henry, the charming and reserved heir to the British throne, as they navigate their secret romance in the public eye. Up next, we have, Simon vs. the Homo Sapiens Agenda, by Becky Albertalli. This beloved novel follows Simon Spear, a high school student who is forced to come out to his friends and family after his secret emails with his anonymous crush are discovered. Our next book is, Carry On, by Rainbow Rowell. This fantasy novel is a spin-off of Rowell's previous novel, Fangirl, and follows the adventures of Simon Snow, a teenage magician who is in love with his arch-nemesis, Baz. Moving on, we have, Call Me By Your Name, by Andrea Keeman. This beautiful and haunting novel follows Elio, a precocious 17-year-old, who falls in love with Oliver, a charming and confident older grad student, during a summer in Italy. It's a poignant and unforgettable story about the intensity and beauty of first love. Next up, we have, The Price of Salt, by Patricia Highsmith. This groundbreaking novel was originally published in 1952 and follows Therese, a young department store clerk, who falls in love with Carol, an older woman going through a divorce. It's a stunning and brave story about love and self-discovery. Moving on, we have, Openly Straight, by Bill Konigsberg. This thought-provoking novel follows Rafe, a gay teen who decides to reinvent himself when he transfers to an all-boys boarding school in order to avoid being defined by his sexuality. It's a compelling and honest story about the pressures and expectations of being a gay teenager. Our next book is, We Are OK, by Nina LaCour. This stunning novel follows Marin, a college freshman who has fled her life in California and is living alone in a dormitory in New York City. The story is a powerful exploration of grief, loss, and the healing power of friendship. Moving on, we have, The Picture of Dorian Gray, by Oscar Wilde. This classic novel is a cautionary tale about the corrupting influence of beauty and pleasure. The story follows Dorian Gray, a young man who sells his soul to preserve his youth and beauty, only to discover the true cost of his vanity. Next up, we have, more Happy Than Not, by Adam Silvera. This heartbreaking novel follows Aaron Soto, a teenage boy from the Bronx, who is struggling to come to terms with his sexuality and his feelings for his best friend. It's a poignant and honest exploration of identity, friendship, and love. Moving on, we have, Annie On My Mind, by Nancy Garden. This groundbreaking novel was originally published in 1982 and tells the story of two teenage girls who fall in love and must navigate the homophobia and discrimination of their community. It's a powerful and moving story about love and resilience. Our next book is, The Miseducation of Cameron Post, by Emily M. Danforth. This novel follows Cameron, a teenage girl who is sent to a conversion therapy center after her conservative aunt discovers she is gay. The story is a powerful condemnation of the damaging and abusive practices of conversion therapy. Moving on, we have, I'll Give You the Sun, by Jandy Nelson. This beautiful and poetic novel follows twin siblings Jude and Noah, who are both struggling with their identities and their feelings for each other. It's a story about love, art, and the transformative power of forgiveness. Next up, we have, Giovanni's Room, by James Baldwin. This classic novel, published in 1956, tells the story of David, a young American man living in Paris, who falls in love with an Italian bartender named Giovanni. It's a powerful and moving exploration of love, desire, and the fear of societal expectations. Moving on, we have, Dreadnought, by April Daniels. This thrilling novel follows Danny Toza, a trans teenager who inherits the powers of a superhero and must navigate the challenges of her new identity while also fighting crime. It's a powerful and empowering story about identity and self-discovery. Our next book is, Boy Meets Boy, by David Levithan. This charming and uplifting novel takes place in a utopian high school where being gay is not only accepted but celebrated. The story follows Paul, a teenage boy who falls in love with Noah, a new student who has just moved to town. It's a heartwarming and hopeful story about love and acceptance. Next up, we have, The Love and Lies of Ruxana Ali, by Sabina Khan. 
This novel tells the story of Ruxana, a Bangladeshi-American teenager who must navigate the conflicts between her conservative Muslim family and her own desires and identity. It's a powerful and moving story about love, family, and the struggle for self-acceptance. That concludes our list of 18 young adult gay novels that we highly recommend. We hope you found some new and exciting books to add to your reading list. Let us know in the comments which ones you've already read or which ones you're most excited to read. Thanks for watching.